Hello there, and welcome to another one of these Lexical Lab One Minute English videos. If you like this video, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and check out our website www.lexicallab.com to find out more about our online courses. There's an old saying that claims a week is a long time in politics. And if you look at what's been going on in the US over the last seven or eight days, you realise the essential truth of this. A week ago, Joe Biden was looking like a doddery, senile old man, and there was talk of a Trump landslide, God forbid, in the autumn. Last Sunday, Joe Biden announced that he wasn't going to be running for re-election in the forthcoming um, presidential elections, and his vice president, his VP, Kamala Harris, came forward. Very quickly, she got the backing of a whole bunch of very influential people in the Democratic Party, and huge amounts of donations came flooding in. Suddenly, there's a renewed optimism around the Dem Democratic Party and hope that Trump and the far right can be beaten in the elections. Basically, her campaign got off to a flying start. If you say that something got off or is off to a flying start, you basically mean it started very well. It's made very good progress in a very short period of time. So a political campaign can be off to a flying start. Or maybe when a new government comes in and very quickly they make a very large number of quite bold, quite progressive changes, you might say that they're off to a flying start. It's sometimes used in football commentary as well. So maybe one team comes out, all guns blazing, and after six minutes, they're 2-0 up. They're winning by two goals to nil. They're off to a flying start. Sometimes it's used in races as well. Maybe one horse gets off to a flying start and is a long way ahead of the other horses after just a few hundred metres. It's also used when you start a new job. So maybe you start in your new job and very quickly it's obvious that you're doing very, very well. You get off to a flying start in your new job. Sometimes you also hear it used in a sort of ironic negative way. So you might say, yeah, when we went on our first date together, we didn't exactly get off to a flying start. Or maybe, yeah, he's doing very well now, but it took him a long time to get to the top. If you look back at his early days, you'll realise his career didn't exactly get off to a flying start. If you've enjoyed this video, please do click the like button. Please share it on social media with your friends, your students, your colleagues. And in the comment section below, we'd love to see examples of how you might use off to a flying start.